You're getting a dog. You got this? Think faster. Yeah, I got this. <laughs> you think I'm afraid of you? Lay down. Rex, lay down. I first met Rex before I was going, before I knew that I was going to be his handler. So when I went to the kennels for the first time at Camp Pendleton, you see all the dogs, and I remember meeting him when I was in a bite suit and he was biting me and being very scared of him. Um, but yeah, he was a great dog. We're shipping out tomorrow. We are so not ready for this. Clear! Levy, check the vehicle! Where's my dog? I need to see him. Oh, no, no, no. Uh -uh. I knew that Rex was a great dog. I've trained, I trained with him in the States and um, he, was, he was great. But once you kind of get thrown into that situation where this is real life, you have to really put all your trust into that dog. And that's, that's, that's hard if you don't trust your dog. So you have to really be very in tune with each other because literally your hand is his, are in his life along with everybody behind you. So that's, that's really scary at first, when you first get out there and it's my first time out there. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna pretend like I know what I'm doing because I'm just gonna, you wanna set the pace and follow your dog and make everybody behind you feel like they're, we're gonna be okay. Senator, can I just have a moment of your time? His name is Rex. He saved thousands of lives in Iraq. What did you say your name was? Corporal Megan Levy. All you gotta do is fight. And you know how to fight. You're a Marine. It's a two-way street. While Rex was working hard and protecting all of us, I also had to be his voice and make sure that I can tell when he's getting tired, he needs a break. Um, there are certain situations that I would say, no, I don't think that's, I don't think we could do that, or I think we should do it a different way. Um, dogs aren't machines, so you have to really advocate for your dog because his, his safety is vital in your safety. If he's not okay to do his job, I'm not gonna be able to do my job to the best of my ability, and that affects everybody around me. I'd thank him for teaching me what love is. 